everyone, and welcome back to the day before. Today we're going to play more Nancy Drew Alibi and Ashes, which is what we're going to be doing all this week on this channel, just to relax, you know, uh, take our minds off of all the frustrations and uh, pain of the world, and, and just have a little bit of fun, right? So let's go ahead and call Nancy Drew's dad, if you've been following along. Nancy Drew was arrested for a fire at the Old Town Hall, but she didn't start it. So she is trying to find out who did. Hello? Do you remember Alexei Markovic? He was one of your first cases. That was a long time ago. Do you think he was guilty? The case wasn't that simple. Why not? There was a lot of evidence stacked up against him. As a prosecutor, I couldn't just ignore it. I know that, but did you think he was guilty? It didn't matter what I thought. I could tell from the start that the jury wanted him locked up. It was a very strange case. I mentioned it to the judge, and he told me that I was too new to the courtroom to make that kind of judgment. I believed him. And now? Now? I don't know. I wish I had listened to my instincts back then. From that day forward, Alexei went on to be an honest member of the community. Interesting. And the Bennington family went on to cause no end of scandal. That right there speaks volumes. What do I do if I can't clear my name? Don't worry about that right now. Oh, okay. It's a little hard <laughs> not to. If it comes to that, you let me worry about the court proceedings. I'm not going to let anything bad happen to you. I guess I'm lucky that I have a prosecutor for a father. And I'm lucky to have a daughter who only rarely goes to jail. Dad! Okay, I'll upgrade it to almost never. Don't worry. <laughs> You're not guilty and you've got me in your corner. We'll get through this. How's Hannah doing? She's so sorry she couldn't be here for you. She said she's rushing back home. I told her that we'd take care of things, but you know how she is. I'd better let you go. Bye. All right. Um, let's call Bess and see if she can't get info out of Brenda. Hi, Nancy. I need you to take over. Bess, reporting for duty. Alright. We can't go in here. <laughs> I almost forgot. Okay. Great to see you again. Is there a way I could get in touch with you later? Good question. Why don't you take one of my cards? My phone's always off when I'm on scene, but I check my messages Perfect. constantly. I'll call back if it's important. If you want to talk about Nancy, off the record even, I'm always there for you. Until next time, drop by if you've got any hot tips. All right, let's give her a call. <laughs> you have reached the Heights 9 Action News Tip Line for Brenda Carlton. Please speak clearly when prompted to report breaking news in the North River Heights area. Say yes, otherwise say no. Yes. You have indicated a breaking news story in the North River Heights area. Brenda Carlton will be notified directly. Goodbye. All right. Oh, where did she go? I wonder. Got it. Okay, perfect. Now let's take a look around. Oh, I can't open that. Oh, let's look around here. That could definitely start a fire. Okay. Okay. Let's see here. All right. Uh, what else do we have to do? Got it. Got it. Got it. I 
can't do that now. Got it. Oh, wow, guys. It looks like all we have left is to get Nancy out of jail. So we may be close to being... Well, I don't know. We'll see. Uh, okay. Police station. We'll drop that off. Um, I think everything else we keep. So let's go ahead and call Nancy and see what's going on. You take the lead now. I'm on the case. Okay. All right, now she has like everyone's fingerprint. Scan him in, guy. Okay. And we also need to have a friend check uh, the mantle where our dad is going to have something sent. Or Nancy Drew's dad is going to have something sent to her. Alright. It's Brenda. <gasps> It's Brenda. Okay. Let's go check out the evidence board. Can you take a look at this? Be right there for an evidence check. I disagree with your cop work there, Nancy. Uh, what else do we need? Um, let's call Ned. Hello? Ned, I need your Ned's expertise. Okay. I see what you did there. This is about Deirdre, isn't it? Yes, we need to distract her. You have to ask her out on a date. I have to what? Just take her out for lunch. Stall her for a while. I'll get a reputation. Ned. Okay, I'll do it. It's weird, but I'll do it. <sighs> Thanks. Your turn to take over. All right, we gotta Ned, do that. Reporting for duty. Let's go to scoop. What's the deal? I waited for you for an hour. I'm sorry, I ran into traffic. All right. Fine. Don't let it happen again. Isn't that exactly the same thing you were wearing before you got <laughs> changed? No, it's completely different. <laughs> I can't believe you didn't even notice. I was wondering if you could go grab some food together. Yes, I would like that. Oh my word. Were you word. able to distract Deirdre? Yes. Great. I'll call Bess or George to go see if she's left anything behind. All right. Ned's got Deirdre distracted. Can you see if she's left anything behind? Drop off anything you find at the station. You got it. I'm passing the case to you, Bess. I'm on the case. Okay. And we'll also check the mantle, too. This is from before the fire yesterday. <gasps> we need to get this to Nancy. Oh my word. Okay. But game over, Nancy Drew. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's go to Nancy's house real quick. <gasps> Nancy. 
Yes, that that's what there. Nancy's dad was getting for her. Perfect. Okay. Great, I think we're almost uh, done with getting Nancy Drew out of jail, guys. Hello? You take the lead now. I'm on the case. All right. I need to check this against the chromatogram results. Which accelerant was used? Mm. The fire was started with isopropyl alcohol, not gasoline. Adding this to the evidence against me will help prove I didn't start the fire. Perfect. Ticket number RH six two seven E four zero one RH. I'm gonna snap a picture of that bolt because I don't know if I remember that. Okay. ballads the number one cause of running red lights wait a second this puts her at town hall right when the alarm was switched off mm. very interesting all right let's see if we have enough evidence yet to get out of jail This is everything I need. Okay, Once perfect. Once I directly match all the evidence to the suspects, I'll be all set. Um. I think I've got enough evidence. On my way. Please, hmm. please, please. Look solid. Looks like you just got yourself a get out of jail free card, detective. Yay! Let's get one more candy bar. Yum. Not an apple. A Yum. cocoa Kringle. Yummy. All right, let's go, folks. Let's get out of jail. Yes, I'm out. Woohoo! All right, let's go home first. Oh, yay. George is here. Nancy, you're out. I was so worried. You have no idea. Thank you for your help. You guys are the best friends in the world. We're not out of the woods. You need anything, you let me know. So, how's the case coming? Okay. Much better now that you're out. We're a team, but I still like it when you lead the way. So, how did Ned do with Deirdre? I have never seen him so stressed out. In any other case, it would have been funny. I sort of feel bad for Deirdre. Only sorta. I don't want to get a reputation here as a softie. Did you find out anything else about Alexei's detective past? Not much. I asked around a little. He solved a lot of tough cases. It's not fair that the town just turned its back on him. 
What if he was really framed? Then we'll take that case next. Goodbye. Until next time. All right, you guys. It is until next time. I am going to go ahead and leave you guys here. And then we will play another awesome game of Nancy Drew Alibi and Ashes. And we actually get to play as Nancy now. Out of jail. So that's exciting. See you guys soon. Bye-bye.